Hello everyone and thanks so much for clicking on my video. Today I'm going to share with you guys a couple of nail facts that I got from the book Nail Structure and Product Chemistry. I've talked to you guys so much about this book because I absolutely love the information I've gotten from it. So let's start right away uh, with first a nail fact. And keep in mind that there's always exceptions to the rule, but as a general rule, this is what scientists have discovered. Number one would be that nails grow 20% faster during summertime. And I don't think I've ever noticed if my nails grow any faster or any slower during summertime. I've just never paid attention, I guess. So during the summer, which is right now, I'm gonna take a look at my fingernails and see if they do grow 20% faster. 20% faster is something, so I will be checking on that. Uh, number two nail fact would be that normally men's nails grow faster, especially on their dominant hand. So I think this is especially true. I do notice that, especially if you have sons and daughters and you can compare them how often you have to clip their fingernails. In my case, the only man that lives in my house is my husband and his nails grow super fast. He can cut his nails Monday and by the time of the weekend gets here, he's got to trim them again. His nails grow super duper fast. And growing up in the house, the only man in my house was my father and his nails also grew fast, super, super fast. So I think that one, I did, I do notice it. Fact number three would be that women's fingernails grow faster during their pregnancy. There I go again. I never noticed anything. I had one pregnancy and I did have my nails long when I was pregnant. Um, once my baby was born, I trimmed them because one time I was changing her diaper and I scratched her fat little leg. I felt so bad that I ended up trimming them and I didn't let my nails grow again until she was a, she was, when she wasn't carrying age anymore. Uh, but yeah, during pregnancy, your nails are supposed to grow faster. I never noticed it. Maybe it has something to do with the prenatal vitamins or just that your body is, I mean, you feel so good when you're pregnant, except for the first three months where you have all the, the nauseousness and all that. But other than that, I felt really good during my pregnancy. So I can see that being true. I never noticed it. Like I never paid attention, I guess. So if you're pregnant, your nails are growing faster. Another fact, which would be, I think it's fact number four, would be that it's a myth that your fingernails need calcium to grow. And I think I made a complete video about this a while back. Um, after studying the nail, scientists have found that our fingernails have less than 0.1% calcium in them. So it's a myth. You hear a lot of uh, vitamins and a lot of nail products that have calcium, but it's a myth. Uh, taking calcium supplements is going to be probably good for your overall health for some people. Some people can't take the calcium, but a direct link to say that your nails will grow faster because of calcium, it's a myth. It's not true. Fact number five would be that the most fragile part of your fingernail is the area where your lunula is. That half little moon, that's the softest, most gentlest part of your fingernail. So you have to be super duper careful with that part of your fingernail, the lunula area. Fact number six, you can tell if a person is right-handed or left-handed, I'm saying that backwards, left-handed or right-handed, if you examine their thumbs, look at their lunulas. The thumbnail that has the largest lunula is going to be the hand the person is dominant with. So for me, I examined both of mine and I have both of mine exactly the same and I'm right-handed, but they're exactly the same. So like I said, there's always exceptions to the rule. I can do things with my uh, left hand, but I'm right-handed. I write with that hand and everything, but both my lunulas are the same exact size. So examine yours and see if that's the case with you as well. Fact number seven is that nails grow a lot slower in winter and during nighttime. I don't think it's such a big difference, but they've studied it and they've noticed that it does. They do grow slower at nighttime and also uh, during the winter. Obviously, it would be during the winter growing slower if they grow faster during the summer. But that's an interesting fact, I thought. Fact number eight is that your thumbnail over your left hand grows. Is it over the left hand? Yeah, your left thumbnail usually grows slightly faster than the one in your right hand. I think that's possible because um, I do notice that this fingernail grows faster than all the rest of my fingernails. But I, you know what? On my left side, my foot is a little bigger and my hand, my fingers are a little thicker on my left hand. 
So I'm thinking, could that have something to do with the fact that your heart is on that side? I don't know, but I do notice that the thumbnail over my left hand does grow faster than the one on my right hand. The one on the right hand grows fast, but I think this one grows a little bit faster. Number nine, as a rule of thumb, the longer your fingers are, the faster your fingernails will grow. I thought that was super interesting. Really interesting. So if you have those long, elegant fingers, your nails grow faster than a person with short fingers like me. Number 10 and the last one. And there's so many more nail facts, but those are the ones that I had written down. Is that if you bite your fingernails, or if you have some sort of trauma to your finger, to your fingernail, damage on your nail plate, or you have the loss of your nail plate, that fingernail is gonna grow faster than the rest of your fingernails. So if you're there biting your fingernails, your nails are actually growing faster than a person that doesn't bite them. That's so interesting to me. If you have some kind of trauma or damage to your nail plate, that nail's gonna grow faster as well. So those are the nail facts that I wrote down a while back and I wanted to make a video on it, but I'm just now making it. And I got all of them from the Nail Structure and Product Chemistry book. I'll write down in the description of the video the pages where I got the information from. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. And if you know a nail fact that's different than the ones I mentioned, please let, let all of us know in the comment section. Or if you find that you're familiarized or that you do agree with some of these nail facts, also let me know. Thanks so much for watching. Kisses and super big hugs. Take care and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.